Hello, happy crafters. Happy Monday. I hope you all had an awesome weekend. Not a lot of swimming for this girl. It was too hot. It's pretty bad when it's too hot to go swimming. Anyways, today I'm coming on for the collab that I co-host with by Mimi with Love and Linda's Creative Life, which is hashtag enjoy purple with us. Now, y'all have seen me use this paper pad a lot. I'm kind of over it, guys. <laughs> and I have a lot of it. So I think after this, I'm going to retire it for a little bit. And then I'll bring it out later. You know how that happens when you uh, you just, you just kind of get over it. But it is beautiful paper pad. So what I would like to show you first, I'm going to also do a VR for Penny's uh, Crafty Creations. And this is for Penny's two-year YouTube anniversary challenge. I will link everything in the description box below. But basically what Penny is asking for is a 3 by 5 I guess you would say, memory decks card um, with your information on it. And she wants a half an inch, which I'll show you. Oh, so I was talking to Mimi, and she's like, add something on to that. So thank you, Mimi, for the suggestion. So I'll show you what I made her. Here we go. So she wants a half an inch left so that she can punch holes in it, and she's putting them kind of like in ring binders. It's very, very, very cute idea. And um, I'll be putting it out in the mail tomorrow. Like I said, check out um, her YouTube video that I'm going to link. And then I just used some of the ephemera. Now on here, you can actually maybe see it. I have some purple stickles. And I just kind of smeared it all around with my fingers. Very simple and nothing um, elaborate, but it's pretty. I really like the way it turned out. And then that's just on the back. She wanted it on an index card, so that's what the back looks like. So I thought that was cute, and of course I got to use my purple. So then the next thing that I made was a birthday card. Actually, I'll show you the ATC first. So I did the same thing with the ATC. This is for somebody else. I'm not saying who because she watches me all the time. And I don't want her to know that it's for her. <laughs> anyway, she's requesting an ATC. I did the same thing here and put the trim in the back. I love these little lysine bags. I'm almost out of them. And then for this ATC, I used Wink Estella. Very simple, very plain. But I just, you know... Let the paper do the work. Yes, please. And then you turn it over, and then I just made a pocket, and then you pull the pocket out, and then that's got all my information in there. So that's my ATC. Now, I had made a card like this, oh, I don't know, a couple years ago, and I forgot all about it, and I was like, oh, I need to do that, and I am going to make more of this kind of card. This is just the envelope that I made for the card. And here's the card. So the card is actually has um, acetate here. So that when you open the card, I don't know if you could see, that's the acetate. So the glue that I used, it left kind of like a really weird film. So I just put the paper in there, and then I stamped in there. I love that saying. <laughs> Hearty laughs and smiley faces and warm hugs. And then I just used some of the embellishments. And then when you fold it, it's clear. You can't really tell, but this was fun to make. It was a challenge because I didn't like the way it glued. But I'm definitely going to make more cards like that for sure. So that's the last you're going to see of this paper pack for a while. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> I hope you all can join in. Uh, join the collab. It doesn't have to be a card. It could be whatever you want. You could show purple flowers or purple beads or buttons. 
whatever it is that brings out the purple in you. So you know what I'm going to say, y'all. I lie you. Hugs and boochies. Bye.